Hey everyone, I hope you all are doing great in your life and in your studies also. So in this video, I am going to discuss how you should prepare arithmetic for RRB PO examination. Okay, many people find arithmetic very confusing. So in this video, I am going to tell you step by step how you can make arithmetic your strongest section. Okay, so first of all, for doing arithmetic, what I suggest to you, first of all, you should do the basic chapters. Okay, like simplification, approximation, number series, these type of basic chapters you should do. And after after understanding the basics, you should daily practice ten to fifteen questions from each four chapters: simplification, approximation, number series, and quadratic equation. You so you should always solve ten to fifteen questions from these chapters on daily basis. All right. Then second thing is the arithmetic chapters. I am telling you the step by step what you should do. First, you should take around seven to eight days to complete the basics of these chapters. Then you will do the arithmetic chapters one by one and start from percentage. Then take ratio proportion. Then there is average. Okay, so these type of uh, chapters you should take and try to solve the questions from level one and level two. Okay, and for basic chapters, I suggest you to go for Anjul Saini Sir's videos on YouTube. Okay, this is the source for arithmetic chapters. You can go for Ashish Arora sir if you want. Like if you have the subscription, then you can go for his classes. And if not, then I suggest you to go for Koshik Mohanty sir's YouTube videos. He has covered all the chapters in one single video. Like you will get one video for time and work, then one video for uh, percentage. So that is the best content available on YouTube. Okay, so try to. Watch his his videos. They are really helpful, and like your concepts will be cleared by one video. So it is very easy and simple to cover the basics from his videos. Okay, so for arithmetic, you can go for his videos and try to make the first ten chapters very strong, like percentage, ratio, proportion. Then there is average, simple interest, compound interest, time and work. Then time, speed and distance. Then there is pipe and cistern, time, speed, I or I think there are like two to three more chapters which are really really very important. Okay, so these chapters are the core of arithmetic. If you skip these chapters, then I don't think that you can clear the cutoff of uh, quants in mains. So please try to pay extra attention to these type of chapters. Okay, the first ten chapters of arithmetic, and then for mensuration and permutation, if you have time left, then you can go for these chapters. All right. So after completing your arithmetic chapters plus like what when you are doing percentage try to solve five di's based on per percentage chapter okay then ratio then five di's on ratio then you are doing simple interest five di's based on simple inter interest so this is the way okay because you will clear your concepts by watching the videos and then. the concepts will help you to solve the dis so you know when you just solve the arithmetic chapters and you do not know the di you do not solve the dis there is a fear of dis in your mind every time and after completing the syllabus when you come back to the dis to complete dis so what will happen you would have forgotten some basics of percentage okay so it is always advisable to cover the dis along with the arithmetic chapters itself okay like today you are you have done level 1 then you can solve five prelims level dis of percentage then level 2 then you can solve some mains level di like rrb po mains then level 3 you can solve sbi po mains level dis so this is the way all right then after completing arithmetic chapters what you should do you should practice the questions you should practice the questions here when you are completing the classes and after that you should practice the questions but these questions must be of previous year papers try to solve at least 8 to 9 previous year papers like chapter wise you should do you know after completing the chapters and when we saw any difficult see any difficult question in any mock test then we think that okay this is the level and i do not know these type of question so there is you know it decreases our confidence but when we solve previous year papers the previous year papers are easy they will help you to build, build your confidence in the things which you have studied okay and your confidence will increase and it will help you to get good marks in the real examination also okay because you know when you solve mock test then the mock test are of very high level and if you think like this that the paper will be of same level then this is the main thing which you should avoid okay so do always try to practice the previous year papers 
एंड इफ यू आर वरीड अबाउट फ्रॉम वेयर टू गेट दिस प्रीवियस ईयर पेपर्स दिस इज द बुक ओके दिस इज बाई किरण पब्लिकेशन बैंक पी ओ क्वान्टिटिव एप्टीट्यूड एंड दीज आर सोल्ड पेपर्स ओके सो इट विल हेल्प यू टू अंडरस्टैंड द कॉन्सेप्ट लाइक इफ यू गेट कन्फ्यूज इन एनी चैप्टर देन द सोल्यूशन आर ऑल्सो गिवन एंड दे आर लाइक you are getting around 12 to 13 years papers in this book okay and i will show you the index first then we can judge so here you can see that all the papers are covered for earlier the paper used to be bank wise like indian bank po ipps bank po then there is this type of okay so the questions are given and the number of questions are also told okay then there is this type of high level papers rbi grade b these type of things are also given and then po mains examination questions are also given and the best thing about this book is that the questions are chapter wise this is the main thing like if you are covering percentage then you can cover all the previous year papers of percentage from this book when we download the pdfs the problem is that the questions are mixed like the previous year papers are available but they are not chapter wise they are given they have given the mixed paper so that is the problem faced by the candidates they are not able to get the chapter wise and it is solved by this book okay like if you are completing percentage chapter and if you solve the previous year papers of percentage chapter in one go then your confidence will be very high when you will see any percentage chapter next time okay and then paper wise questions are given then there is sbi po rbi grade b then there is insurance examination sorry so the paper wise questions are given this is the best thing plus the chapter wise questions are given then there is ibps po sbi po examinations and this is the best thing i found about this book and if you want to purchase this book the link will be given in description from there you can go and purchase then after covering the previous year papers now that is the time to attempt the mains mock test okay for pre you can start from here from arithmetic chapters along with arithmetic you can start the prelims level chapters when you are completing the basics okay and for the mains examination after solving the previous year paper that is the right time when you will start the mains exam mains mock test okay and mains mock test you can start and try to practice around 5 dis of mains plus 10 to 15 mains level arithmetic questions on daily basis that is the way okay first you will do the previous year paper and then five mains di is on daily basis and 10 to 15 mains level arithmetic questions and along with when you are attempting the mains mock test keep revising your basics this is also very important okay keep revising your basics of these chapters and when you are attempting the mains mock test like you can give, you can take one chapter for one day so that is the way to prepare your arithmetic okay you can write this thing in the in your diary and you can use it when you are starting your beginner like if you are a beginner when you are starting or if you are already preparing then at whatever phase you are you can just start start following this so that is all for this video thank you and have a nice day